BPS. The robotic surgeries began back in 2019 and continue to help advance patient care. Here to talk more about this major accomplishment is Dr. Mitchell Garden, Gardner. Uh, Garden, he is an orthopedic spine specialist at Charlotte Hungerford Hospital. Thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you. Tell us exactly what is the Globus Excelsius GPS and how does this technology assist surgeons? Well, what it is, it's a navigation system that assists us in doing the surgery in the sense that it helps us pre-plan how we're going to be placing pedicle screws or other inner body or other implants into the spinal area ahead of actually doing the surgery. Now, this um, No, go ahead. I'm sorry. Yeah, and, and what it does is it, it allows a more accurate placement or more precise placement of these uh, implants. I was going to say, this sounds very interesting. So who exactly typically needs this form of surgery? Uh, it, it, for spinal patients that are undergoing uh, any type of procedure where you're going to use hardware, such as inner body implants or pedicle screws, uh, that's typically in uh, fusions, uh, uh, procedures that uh, require destabilization or decompression of the spinal canal, uh, trauma type patients, scoliosis. And what would you say are the benefits of uh, this particular technology? Uh, it has definitely uh, decreased surgical time, um, less blood loss, smaller incisions, and the patients are typically getting out well under 24 hours uh, going home with much less pain. And what would you say is the most interesting robotic case you've seen or performed with this particular technology thus far? Uh, to be honest, I don't think it's really changed much in the procedures that I was doing ahead of time. It's just it's this allowed me to uh, do these cases much more efficiently with less, less blood loss and less trauma to the patient overall. And let's talk about advanced procedures. Let's talk about that. What are some of those? Well, it's, it certainly allows for much bigger procedures, scoliosis, where you can be operating all the way from you know, the, the lower cervical spine down to the pelvic area, um, even pelvic procedures as well. Um, so it, it definitely has widened how many procedures and, uh, that, that you can perform. And, of course, this is definitely high tech. So what would you say was possibly the learning curve uh, getting to use this, uh, this particular form of technology? It, it actually wasn't too bad, which, which impressed me with this system. Prior to getting the, the system at Charlotte, I had been looking around for about two years, uh, looking at different systems. And this is one of the systems that, uh, when I looked at it, watched other surgeons perform it, that it, it said, okay, this is something that works within my practice and my patients. So it, it wasn't a, a really steep learning curve overall. Mm -hmm. Modern medicine, definitely interesting there. Well, Dr. Mitchell Garden, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, he's an orthopedic spine specialist at Charlotte Hungerford Hospital. Thanks again for joining us. Thank you. You bet. Have a